you know, our ladies were able to um, regroup, and um, it feels good to get back to Lady Aggie basketball. This team average that we played tonight averages 68 points a game, and we held them to 57. Uh, we got rebounded 54 to 31. Um, and then people just showed up and made big plays. You know, Kayla Green, Leo Kilpatrick, Dana Brown, our bigs. You know, even though statistically it didn't show that they um, did anything, but they were very impactful in terms of making their team have to really focus on them and our guards had to go to work. I mean, they're going to be key the rest of the season, and I hope they continue to, to do the things they did tonight. Um, and I told them that we're going to go as they go, and I hope, you know, this big win against um, the sixth best mid-major in the country in terms of rankings right now shows them that we can, one, go in and compete against everybody, and two, if we do the things that we work on in practice, we'll come out with a victory. Yeah, know, well, we talked about, you know, where we were after the UCLA game and uh, the games prior to that and just wanted to refocus, you know, um, and think about what you can do in terms of yourself individually to help us. And, um, I thought, you know, based on the outcome of the game, I mean, I've been, I've been tough on them since we got back. You know, they, when they told me only like a few people worked out while, we, while they were gone and all that stuff, and it kind of, you know, ticked me off. But um, I mean, this here shows that they did some more mental versus physical. Just basketball in general, men and women's basketball, like if you can dominate the glass, there's a good chance you're going to win the game. And if we can continue to do that, then we're going to put ourselves in position, you know, to win and hopefully be in position to win the championship next year. I mean, yeah, yeah, next year.